Hello everyone, welcome back. We have got a Silver Age Showcase, part one. So these are um, the Silver Age books that we got in that haul back when I first started the channel. Should have done an unboxing, should have done a, a haul video, a find video, or whatever you want to call it at that time, but I was still learning. I was still a wee little lad. So now we are going to kind of go through these box by box. Hopefully you guys like this kind of stuff. I know you guys like Silver Age content, because I do, and uh, it seems like you guys really enjoy that kind of thing. So I'm gonna kind of go through these very quick. I just want you guys to kind of see what we have. Now, grade-wise, these are kind of in that three to five range, okay? 3.0, 5.0. Not high grades. Best situation would be mid grades. A couple, several of these have detached covers. Some of these have torn covers. That's just the nature of the beast. Um, all right, without further ado, let's kind of get into these. I'm gonna start out with these Adventure Comics. So this is Adventure Comics 352. A lot of these are super blue. So a lot of these books are gonna be um, kind of in that Ten dollar book, fifteen dollar book. Um, here's three sixty five, and I I don't have these. I think I have some of these sequentially ordered. Um, three seventy one. So this is the Legion of Superheroes, still in that Superboy run. This is three seventy two. Oh wow, these are actually really sequential. Three seventy three. I think this is a minor key here. 381, it's really washed out. Colors are real faded. This, I believe, is also a minor key as well. Uh, Adventure Comics 425, that's when they start becoming 20 centers. Here's 428, this is the first appearance of Black Orchid. Um, she may be coming um, in, in some form or fashion. Uh, Adventure Comics 308. Oh, this is a cool one. This is an old one. And I'm just kind of enjoying these covers with you guys. Um, you know, I I did obviously bag and board all these, but I uh, can't remember everything we have here. This is 309. I got a bad spine roll. Oh, this is a cool one. Superboy, Legion of Superheroes again, 324. So I guess this whole, I don't know when Superboy started in Adventure Comics. That may have been, he may, that may have been his first appearance. Let me know in the comments if I'm wrong about that. Which I probably am. This one's beat up here. It's got a sticker on it and everything. 335. There's 348. Wanted as the Rogue Legionnaire. We accept you, Universal. You are now one of us. Here's crying, Superboy. Supergirl. Real sad. Real sad. Forgotten Legion. Smallville cleanup campaign. Keep our city beautiful. 351. A lot of these got these bad spine rolls. Elite Impossible Missions, 323. And at one point earlier this year, I kind of went through these just to kind of make sure I didn't have like, wasn't like sitting on like a gold mine or anything. Um, these are kind of in that, I mean, obviously they're not worthless, but they, they definitely have that, they're kind of like five, $5, $10 kind of range especially in their condition. Here's 347. I really need to put these in sequential order because man, I might have like a darn near full, not full run, but a lot of these here from like 330-ish to 370. There's 356, there's 336. Shocking, unguessable, the true identity of the Starfinger. Starfinger. <laughs> Dr. Mantis Morlow, the chemical conqueror and his fantastic chemoids. 
does that not just scream 1967 or what? Here's 367. There's a Chemical King. They're all, they're all in, the, in the glass. Oh no, what's going to happen? Here's 311. Chameleon Boy, Shrinking Violet, Cosmic Boy. It's so funny looking at these because I'm reading the boys right now and just like reading their names and like looking at them. And if you guys have read the boys run, it's just so funny. <laughs> oh, Extra Tales of the Bizarro World. I think um, a Superboy book is the first appearance of Bizarro. I don't think we'd have, we'd have that. I would, I would definitely remember that. All right. Here's, and there's several Spectre books in here. There may be um, a kind of a run of those. Okay, here's something totally random that shouldn't have been in here. Army War Heroes. Number 24. Army War Heroes. Number 22. Man, this is a crazy cover. It's like a, a mask of hit. DC Star Spangled War Stories 156. This will be the most dangerous role I've ever played. So this is the Unknown Soldier. Spoiler alert. If you guys stick around for our additional Silver Age showcases, we have some first appearances in there, including the Unknown Soldier. Here's Sergeant Rock, which this needs to go. Hey, see, a couple of these are mixed up. I had these all in order. Uh oh, here's a key up here. There's another Sergeant Rock. Here is Sergeant Fury and his Howling Commandos number three. That is cool. So, I don't know if you guys knew this, but uh, Sergeant Fury had both his eyes. Uh, he looks quite a bit different than Samuel Jackson. <laughs> and uh, yeah, and he had his Howling Commandos back in the day. So this is Sergeant Fury number 34. Don't know why those are in there. All right, here back to Adventure Comics. Supergirl. This is 419, so I guess we get away from Superboy at that point, which would make sense because we saw um, Spectre. Here's Weird Adventure Comics, 25 cents, 437. Okay, so I guess there was a little Supergirl run here. He's got ooh, Black Canary, Dr. Midnight, and the Phantom Stranger. It's too late for me. Save yourself. Venture Comics Aquaman Action. 441. Oh, here's an old one. This is one you definitely couldn't make today. Featuring the fat Superboy. Yikes. Don't worry, Lena. I'll turn you over to the police emergency squad so they can pry you loose. I don't dare let Lena know that I'm also I've also become fat. Oh my gosh. That is number 298. Venture Comics Supergirl 428. Venture Comics 439. There's the Spectre. The Spectre. See, now this looks cool to me. This is cool art. Um, now that's something I would like to get a poster of. Art for now. That's sweet. Venture Comics 427. I like you. 436. See, here's that little Spectre run I was talking about. Obviously, not the first appearance of Spectre because I. I think he was a golden age boy. He was, a, he was back in the day. Okay, here's back into Superboy and the Legion of Superheroes. I think some of these have like the first appearances of those Legion of Superheroes. I don't know their, all their names. 422. Here is a weird adventure comics, but I think that is still, just because it says weird, it's still adventure comics. Spectre. So my first introduction to Spectre was reading. Uh, Swamp Thing, uh, Absolute, which I love. Here's 432. Let me know if you guys like this kind of thing. I, I, I feel like you guys are going to like this. Um, I, I mean, I know from my personal experience, I love seeing old books. Not necessarily keys, but uh, still just so cool to see these old books. 368, if you guys are staying with me, I appreciate it. Adventure Comics 366. Weird Adventure Comics. Whoa, this is cool. So his head is like coming off. 376. Chameleon Boy is doomed. 
More Supergirl action. Aquaman. Starring Aquaman and the Seven Soldiers of Victory. Who are the Seven Soldiers? Tune in next week, Sports Fan. Comic Fan. Adventure Comics 345. I gotta put these in order. If I was prepared, if I had these in order for Cameron, gosh, how dare me. This is the Legion Chain Gang. Uh oh. They got him in a jewel mine. Not Superboy. Not the Legion of Superheroes. I gotta get like a an omnibus of this or something. I mean, I have too many of these issues to not. Pharaoh lad. He's got the FE, the atomic symbol of iron? Right? Or FE. Yeah, I think I, I have to look that one up. FE. My uh, chemistry knowledge is failing me. Okay, th this right here is, I believe, the first in the run of Spectre on Adventure Comics. That is sweet. That is sweet. The end. Oh no, it's the end of the Legion. Off limits to Legionnaires. The Museum of Fear. Very cool. Push these aside here. All right, let's jump into some action comics. So now I think this might be the second appearance of the Parasite. I don't think we have the first appearance. This is another action comics, 304. Okay, so now we got some giant size issues. So this is an 80 page giant, number 347, Action Comics. I think this is still in the Action Comics run. I mean, I think it's still Action Comics 347, if I'm not mistaken. Even though it's a giant, giant size issue. It's another one. Action Comics 355. So this is when it's, this is super. So obviously, um, Action Comics number one, first appearance of Superman. We don't have that one. We, we, we don't have it. We've got Action Comics 350. That is cool. Incredible. How could a Superman have lived and died a million years ago? Secret of the Stone Age Superman. That is cool. I'm gonna read that. The case of the Superman Impossible. Oh man, he's making like voodoo dolls. Action Comics 413, the voodoo. The Voodoo Doom, Voodoo Doom. It's an interesting thing to say. All right, Action Comics, 412. Secret of the First Metropolis. That's cool. I need to read more Superman. We just got, we got a couple of Superman slabs. We got Superman number 199, first time, Superman and Flash Race, and then we have First Appearance of Doomsday, Man of Steel number 18. Those are my Superman slabs. 411 actually comes here some 20 cent action. Ooh, this one. This one's got some paint. This one's got like a paint stain of some kind on this. 370. Look, Superman, one hand. Zavom the Incredible. <laughs> this is like a ripoff of uh, Popeye. This is Action Comics 421. We got a straight like Popeye character right there. Gorilla Grodd. Cool. Gorilla Grodd. Action Comics 424. Stay away, Superman. Superman, you scare me to death. 416. Here's Superman punching some little squirt guy that's wearing his underpants on the outside. Cap Meet the puny powerhouse, Captain Incredible. Oh man, there's like Brainiac right here. Lois Lane, Batman, Jimmy Olsen, they're all tied up. Conspiracy of the Crime Lords and Metamorpho strikes again. Superman lifting some cars. Is a cool one. More Superman. The Made to Order Menace. Created a bigger and better Superman. Action Comics 415. 
So we got some Teen Titans action right here. Teen Titans number seven. Aqualad, Kid Flash, Wonder Girl, and of course, Robin, the boy Wonder. It's a cool one. Oh, look at this pink cover, this is sweet. Aqualad. Twang. Teen Titans number 11. Ooh, Teen Titans number five. Oh wow, we got number four. Holy cow. Ooh. Ooh, this one's torn. Number three, three, three. Torn there. Comics 341. They don't need Superman anymore. I'm through. Finished. Superman guilty of homicide? Say it ain't so. Crypt. Kryptonite Rumble. Man, everybody's got Kryptonite rocks in that one. 342. Oh, wow, this is cool. Superman's Nightmare Dreams. All the back clues are on this cover. Oh, he's like in a nightmare. Some kind of prism creature. The President of Steel. Half a Superman? Say what? Actually, comes 290. That's old. Holy cow. That's him. He's the man who killed my daddy. Oh, Superman. Superman's always getting into shenanigans. Oh man, here's Superman rags to riches. He's got the uh, he's got the hobo socks with the toes sticking out. Masked Superman. So you thought you could beat me, eh? I'll crush your skull like an eggshell. See, my favorite is when Superman like act badly. I guess that's why I kind of like calling them. I'm talking about the boys. That's all I'm talking about is the boys. I got boys on the mind. 365. 328. The face of fear. Here's 348. Who is this guy? Is this Metal Earth now? I can't remember. Muto the Monarch of Menace. This is not Metamorpho at all. It's Muto. 338. Will the real Superman please stand up? Man, that's got me wanting to listen to some, some Eminem. All right, we got some World's Finest right here. Saving the best for last. World's Finest 167. World's Finest 164. So this is a collaboration. Superman and Batman and Robin. 133. This is some weird art on this one. 165. I must destroy this last Batman. This one's beat up. 152. 159. Here's where Superman and Batman. The sons of Superman and Batman, the abominable brats. How would you punish them for their practical jokes? Aw. Here's the world's finest 161 without a cover. Here's a giant size world's finest 179. I don't think this is a world's finest. I just I have to put this in here because it uh, was Batman and Superman. Here's another World's Finest 206. So I guess these are multiple stories in one. Oh man, this is an old one. World's Finest 130. Holy cow. I can tell they're old by uh, the printing of the 12 cent mark. 163. Oh, that's a cool one. Got a Joker cover. The Duel of, of the Crime Kings. 177. Okay, so Muto. Shoot, do we have the first appearance of Mito? I don't know. I gotta look that up. World's Finest 136. What would have happened if Orphan Bat Bruce Wayne had also been adopted by the Kents? Interesting. World's Finest 174. Whoa. The power that transformed Batman. 128. That's an old one too, man. 68. 
here's a classic cover. I think I almost got this one slab. I think I almost got this one slab too. I decided against it because they're grades. I think this is the second appearance of Batgirl. Guys, let me know what you guys think about this. Um, I'm planning on doing a few of these, making a kind of a run of these videos. Let me know what you think. I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you to the people that stayed to the end. Thank you to the new subscribers. Hope everybody's staying safe. Take care.